Air RC Mafia, I've got a parcel today. Um, I've changed my name as well, apparently, to Dan. Yes, Dan, this is the dynamite kit, buddy. That's amazing. Don't need to see that. Um, I've heard so much about these, and now I've got one. <sighs> I can see what all the fuss is about. These are just brilliant. They've got, I don't need any more tools, that is. So, from all that up there to this. So these are brilliant Dan, thanks buddy, yours is in the post now, it's gone, so you might get it either tomorrow or Monday morning, but it's gone matey, I've put a load of stuff in there, I haven't told you I'm going to put in there, there's something in there for Jane, so, and there's something in there for you, bits and bobs, few spares that I've found that I threw in, um, the E-Revo stuff that Darren sent me, it's, um, Literally two shafts, the, the things for the yokes on each end, a few to push your odd ends, but the spares, so you've got spares if you need them now, haven't you? But that is brilliant, mate. Um, people don't know about this company, Dynamite. They're actually part of the Fast Tracks or CML, I think, you know. But it's this. This is the big thing I've heard a lot about. The way you can adjust it where you want everything. and oh, These are brilliant. Dan, you're a good... Good lad. I like the way they're double ended as well, so you can. I've got everything I need, don't need another tool kit. I can now sell my tools on. Um, but I've got a tool box down there, so I'm going to use it as a tool box. Found this before. Milk for sports for all. I got this from my school back in the day. They gave these away free of charge. Slayer. World of shit. Um, <clears throat> and also, for cleaning your legs and bodies I use that it's just normal cleaning stuff you use for um, TV screens um, clean for the outside when you've been on the road and this really buffs them up it really makes it look like by the end of the day it's any sugar as well I think it's just a bit of bloody detergent water isn't it? that's all it is got it from Powerland um, <clears throat> that's it right pull that up a bit <clears throat> right why are we going about that Daz, I might have some stuff coming for you. I've got a box coming for you in Doc Connie, so when you and Connie get it, you'll have some bits. Not much, you know, but I'm only this much really getting to. Right, that's my stuff. I didn't get to bed till seven, half seven in the morning. Um, I think Percy looks crap, but I'm, I've always been a fussy twat. Um, Mm, still need to get these bulkhead tops bits that go here, uh, the top boxes, so I've got that coming. So these are going to stay slack, but I, I, um, I'm going to ask a silly question now. And if you want to take the piss, well, fair enough. Um, how do you stop them from turning when you've got your wheels on? Because they keep turning, and I don't know why they keep turning, and they shouldn't be turning. And when I put my drive shafts in, they're just going to turn. So, how the shit do I stop them? Have I got them on the right way? I don't know. Have I got them on the right way on the rear? I don't know. I've just looked at every diagram possible and it looks fucking skew if, but it's not. It's just me and my human eye going a bit ballistic. Last night I got the front looked more bent than the front, but no, no, it's just me being a diddy. Um, I've now ordered the the other version is with a bigger plate and a bigger mount so I can experiment with the two but this 8 turn brushless one I'm getting 380 brushless it's quite a lot, it's like I don't know, it's about 44, 30 kV or something like that so I'll give it a go anyway um, testing this first, get it on the road, that's the main point but I don't know if I want it long, long legged so to speak is that the front or the back? that's the fucking back isn't it? Um, that's the front, so they're the front so, I haven't got a clue, you know. I haven't got a clue what the hell I'm doing. But I've got that done anyway, so. Just waiting on bits now. I've had to order some M310 grub screws um, they wanted me to buy every yoke and I wasn't intended to do that because Darren's put every yoke in with the, the bag of bits so you know for 50 of them cost me £1 from buying all these 
yoke, so to speak. But what's got me, maybe just me, but it just seems to be. I don't know if I built it wrong, so the truth, but I'm going to keep quiet and let you have a look at it now. See, they're just flying all over the place because they've got the, the crap, so. And how would you stop them from coming out? Do you have to put a piece in it to stop it because they're very exposed, aren't they? Well, I don't know. Um, I suppose when I put the the back on it and that little clip in together, and then, but it's getting there, isn't it? But there you go, anybody. Um, the arms are a little bit too wide for my liking, so I might shorten the arms a little bit. So I want it to have the Merv look, but it's not going to be the Merv. It's going to be like a hybrid of everything, so... But have I put the back ones on right? Are they the back ones or the front ones? Have I put the back ones on right? I don't know. See, these are sticking out like mad, and they don't go down either. I'll go and swap with a the hammer. There you go. Now, I think that must have a cover that goes over it to stop it from moving, so... Still going to get that yet. <laughs> um, that's it for now on Cobra. I've got to wait on more bits. It's near enough there. Just leveling up and shit, but there you go. Um, I've got a box coming to da uh, Darren. And I'll just show you that again. There you go. Ooh, look at me! Thanks to my friend, Scray66. Look at that. I had some goob on my inbox the other day asking me if he could send me this and send him that and do you want... No, don't give things away mate, I'm not a chump. You know what I mean? Who the fuck do you think we are, you cheeky little bastard? We don't give shit away, we're the Mafia, we don't work like that. Get apart and run. But that now is my number one toolkit, that's got its own little space, which is right there. Don't need the box. I've got the receipt anyway, just in case anything happens to them. But that's brilliant. Now I'll change your name to Dan. So there you go. Thanks, Dan. Thanks, everybody. RC Mafia. Stay safe. Happy bashing. And um, remember, if you can't make it go quick enough, Kazoo.